you use any to end to build automations, then this is a game changer because Claude can now build the automation workflows for you just by you prompting it. But here's the thing, for it to actually work, you need to set it up correctly. So I've already done it and I'm gonna show you how. If you wanna set this up yourself, make sure you save this so you can come back and go through the steps because I'm gonna go through this pretty fast. First, you need to connect Claude to the N8N MCP. This is what lets Claude actually understand how N8N works. Then set up a project for N8N automations. You need really detailed setup instructions so Claude knows exactly what to do and what the output should be. You still need a really detailed prompt describing what your automation is. So in a separate chat, work with Claude, explain what your automation is and get it to write the prompt for you. Once your prompt's ready, make sure you have extended thinking on and that you're using Sonnet 4.5. And you can see here that Claude uses the MCP connector to find out what nodes exist and how they connect. You'll then get a full breakdown on what it's set up and how it works. It'll even give you the final setup instructions, which is usually how to connect the credentials. Then just download the code as a JSON file, upload that file to any then and you'll get your draft automation. And in this example, I used a more complex workflow to show you how good it is. So anything that's read just means you have to connect your credentials, so you need to connect your account. This one listens to Slack, transcribes voice notes if needed, uses ChatGPT to figure out if it's a project, a meeting, or just a quick task. Then depending on the intent, it either creates a Trello card, creates an event in my calendar, or adds a lead to Superbase. And then I get confirmation back in Slack. Honestly surprised about how good it has been in my initial tests, but remember you still need to connect credentials. Sometimes a node or two will be broken, but it can definitely save you hours in the initial setup. If you want me to share the exact setup instructions, including the prompts I used, then just let me know in the comments and I'll send that across. And if you found this useful, follow our channel for more.